What's up guys, here's Claudio from Visual Model WordPress Teams and in today's video we're gonna learn how to use a hero section using the borderless free WordPress plugin by Visual Model and Elementor but before we can start, let me show you one example or some examples of hero sections here is one of the pre-built websites that everyone that is using Enzo WordPress team or Borders WordPress plugin can install with one click. And as you can review here at the top, we have a single image, okay, as background, a button, normally a call to action, a text, and a title, okay. This is one good hero section example. Normally, hero sections are very common design elements that if you review, it's present in almost every website normally it comes in the top of the site whoever you can apply wherever you want okay so no problem in the case that you want to apply this in the middle of the design it changes according to your design okay let me show you another one as you can review we have a logo a title and some description this is a hero section we could be even applying some buttons right here for example try free or purchase just some examples okay and this is another demonstrative website of Enzo WordPress team by Visual Mode. All for free, of course. But let's get it started. But before, could you please take a moment to hit the subscribe button, like this video, and share this content with a friend of yours. You have no idea how much it helps us, okay? How much it motivates us. Because we bring daily videos on our YouTube channel about WordPress, plugins, SEO, landing page, sales, and many more topics, okay? So let's get it started on our WordPress dashboard. I'm gonna start at the point assuming that you already have our Borders WordPress plugin installed on your site. You can install it from WordPress.org, no secret, WP, dashboard, plugins, add new, search for Borders, install and activate. Simple, easy and free. And starting at the point that you already have Elementor WordPress website builder plugin previously installed no need to worry you can keep it using the elementor free version okay after these two simple steps we can go to page add new and create a new page or go to a previously made page for example if you are on your website home page and would like to edit this page which is my case you can review the top bar of your WordPress section and click into this button, okay? Edit with Elementor. Click on it. Elementor website editor gonna be opening so you can edit your page. And if we can start it, we can apply the element into the, the bottom of the site and move it to the top or just click into this button right here so we can apply a new element to the top and how to apply review the left side of menus right here okay the sidebar and scroll it down until you find a section called borders okay right here and from this section you can see all the borders wordpress plugin free elements free widgets the one that we're gonna be using for this tutorial is gonna be the hero, whoever we have other ones that may be useful for a section. The split hero and the slider. The slider I already have a video tutorial explaining how to use. Just go to our YouTube channel or search for slider, borderless, visual model, and you're gonna be able to find it, okay? But to this video, we're gonna be exploring this nice guy right here, the hero. Click on it, hold the bottom of your mouse drag it and drop into this section or into any section that you want to apply this element okay so i'm gonna drop it right here and the magic begins as you can review we already have a title and the subtitle and a new section did open or on our left sidebar the very first one it's the place where we're gonna be typing our title the second one, it's the place that we're gonna be typing our subtitle, for example, amazing WordPress theme, free for everyone. Let me show you an example, okay? 
the title gonna be borders and the subtitle gonna be widgets, elements and templates for Elementor. And the bottom can be added. Let me copy this link. Instead of this reg tag, we can apply a bottom. So, the bottom text, okay, gonna be download, the bottom link, gonna be the borders WordPress page on wordpress.org, we can apply an icon in the case that you want, we can use the icon library or upload your SVG icon, you can change the icon position, whoever, a nice feature, it's an option to apply a new bottom, okay, for example, let's imagine that you need two bottoms on your section, this is possible right here. As you can review, we have button 1 and button 2. You can click on the X to remove it. As you can check, no button, it's displaying. Why? Let's go to the settings, that is the next tab into the section, and show title, show subtitle, and we need to enable the show button option. Here is our button. We can apply some animation in the case that you want. The content widget can be full widget or boxed, okay? Now, let's go to other edition parts. The H, the widget, the vertical position, the horizontal position, the text align for title, subtitle, header, we can apply some paddings in the case that you want, okay? Top, right, bottom and left. Right here we're gonna start editing the other options, for example the hero background. It's set to be a solid color, however we can apply an image. For example, this nice image right here. Here is the image. And we still can use the color. We can change the position of the image to all of those sections. We can change the attachment of the image, for example, screw or fix it. So we can create this parallax effect, okay? We can set the image to repeat or to not repeat. And the size can be the full, auto or cover. I recommend you use the cover, okay? But it's totally up to you. Now, let's go to other option, hero background overlay, okay? Right here we're gonna be using our color. So, Classic, Gradient, and Opacity. <laughs> Let's... Pick a color. For example, this dark color. And... Let's apply some Opacity. As you can review, we can change the intensity of the image as background in order to make it more visible or less visible. I think this one right here, 0 0.3, it's good enough. We can apply some CSS filters in the case that you want as well, okay? Very complete. After this, we have the title. For title, we can change the color, typography, text stroke, text shadow, and the blend mode. Okay? Apply padding, margin, and border radius. Same for subtitle and for the bottoms, okay? We have the advanced tab, 
that is normal on Elementor, a place where I can apply custom CSS classes, change sizes, change widgets, okay? Let's check how does it looks on the front end of our site. Click on update button to save the changes, okay? And let's review how does it looks like. So let's check our site. Here is the result we got. In the case that the, your site isn't, isn't set as full widget, okay, you can go to the section where the element is located using this button right here and into the layout set as full widget and into stretch section, okay, set yes, update and you are good to go, okay. Let's try to apply a new button right here, so we have two buttons. At eating, this one gonna be named it view more, maybe. And this one gonna be linking to the visual model website. Just like this. Maybe you can try to apply more things on our buttons. For example, using the style tab, we're gonna go to our buttons. You can change the style of the button, the gap between the buttons, so we can make it more closer, okay? After this, we can change the color of the text and of the background, okay? Let's imagine that you would like to make the button bigger, okay? The font, for example. Click into this on typography and on the size, we can increase the size in the case that you need. I think that we are good to go right here. In the case that you don't like your change, click on back to the full and you are good to go. There are other things that we can do on the typography, for example, the transform, we can make all the text to be uppercase, for example, like this. You can apply some decoration, line H, all simple, easy and effective. And your hero section is already created, simple and easy. And it is. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Feel free to use the comment section below in the case that you have any question. Don't forget to check out the Borders WordPress plugin, okay? It's an amazing tool that's gonna give you lots of options like this one that I did explain how to use and many more, including widgets, elements, templates, and tools for your WordPress, Elementor, Gutenberg, Block Editor, WP Bakery, and many more options, okay? Moreover, in the case that you are in need of an amazing free WordPress team to use your plugins and create your site fast without needs to pay anything go to wordpress.org or go to our wordpress dashboard go to appearance themes add new and search for our enzo wordpress team this is the best free wordpress team that you can download okay i can ensure you of this moreover 
In the case that you are without time to create your site section by section and need to start with a pre-built website with almost unlimited elements, options and count on our 7 days per week. Support. Go to visualmoto.com and purchase our Visual Moto Pass, Borders Pro or Enzo Pro products, ok? So you can choose from hundreds of pre-built websites, thousands of sections, layouts and pages so you can import with a single click, create your site and put it online in just a few minutes, ok? And it is. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I see you tomorrow. All the best!